My river rocks may seem like any old John boat, but sparks have flown high from the moment I first laid eyes on it. Now that may sound figuratively, but I mean it quite literally. I was almost two miles from my house after the purchase when the leaf spring snapped and the axle smashed the pavement, leaving me with the dilemma of how to get home. Now if you know me, you already know that I drug it the remainder of the way, throwing sparks of steel and magma two car lengths across the highway and digging a two-inch gash down Chapel Hill Road. Legend has it, that gash is still there. We've been through it all, from crabbing 200 crab pots by hand to taking it five miles offshore in search of the deep blue. Now this day is no different, and the River Ox is still a champ. So we made it out, we got a beautiful sunrise, and the target species for today is Atlantic Bonito. I'm thinking I'm gonna get some mixed blues and Spanish in there as well, but we're starting to really see those early signs of spring, so I'm really excited to get out and try to get on some fish. All right, it's not too crazy right now. There's only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven boats out here, so I'm really excited. Let's get to fishing. All right, we're on, we're on. First cast, first cast. Feels, uh, feels bluey. No, actually, no, it might be a Spanish. Yep. All right, oh, lost him at the boat. <laughs> Let's get back out of there, second cast. All right, what I'm doing guys is just casting out and getting a five to 10 count and just, oh, I just got hit. Yeah, five to 10 count and then reeling back to me. All right, we're on, we're on. This feels like the good one. This feels like the good one. Yeah, I think this is a Bonita. It does not start around me yet. Oh, no, nope, no, nope. ah, I can't tell. Either it's a nice Spanish, ah, I think it's Bonita. But I don't think he knows he's hooked yet. <laughs> the way he's swimming. I can see my line like cutting through the water back and forth. About to see here in a second. Yep, Bonita. That's a good one. Yeah, we got, it. We got several stuff. Good. I didn't mean to get this close to y'all. I think my anchor drug a little bit. I'm gonna let off a little drag on him because I don't wanna pull the hooks. This is one of my favorite fish to catch. himself out you always have a couple more runs in them where you mess up the most with these fish is right at the boat so I'm trying to be very careful you got to get that head up once that head goes up it's done for there we go. all right here's the first one of the year target species acquired There he is. That's a Spanish show. He hit it right at the boat. <laughs> yep. I told my buddy I'd save him some, so I'm gonna do that. Parker, this one's for you, brother. Where'd it go? Here we go? We're on again, yo. Know? This fish is pretty far from the boat. I'm thinking Spanish for now. It doesn't have that backbone that the Bonita has. You can fool me. Oh, actually, yeah. Spanish. Alright. Well, that'll work. Never drop one in the net like that without actually putting the net out to get him. Yeah. It feels pretty good too. This one's a little bit bigger than that last one. What I'm doing, y'all, is uh, I'm casting out basically as far as I can sling it, letting it drop, and I'm, I'm variating the, the time that it drops between 7 and 15 seconds. And there must be a school of Spanish off that side of the boat right now, so. 
I'm just gonna keep slinging it that way until uh, until they tell me they're done. My buddy did tell me he wanted to he wanted some Spanish, so he's got three in there right now. So I just cast it out. I'm gonna count. I think that was a 12 second count. So counting to 12, and then I'm just reeling back as fast as I can. If you're catching bluefish, that means that you're not reeling fast enough. The Manita, they like it really fast, which the Spanish do too. But I feel like you get a lot more uh, variation with Spanish in comparison to the Bonita. They just like it quick all the time. Spanish, they kind of bounce back and forth between what they like. You got to figure them out. There we go. Right. Well, I think this feels like a Spanish. Yeah, I mean, these Spanish are fun when they get in that 13 to 20 inch range. It's just, oh, lost them. Lost them at the boat. <laughs> well, that's gonna wrap us up. It's starting to white cap out here and I, I gotta be cautious in this little boat. But uh, hey, that's an hour and a half trip. Knocked out a few Spanish, got a Bonita. I call it a success. So I appreciate you guys watching. If I can help y'all with any real estate needs, y'all let me know. I'll catch you on the next one.